we're underground. We're right by the side of the Great Bath. Uh, we're in an area called the Undercroft. The investigation that's taking place at the moment is to reopen some of the earlier excavations which took place in the 1960s to see in what way they might be able to play a role within the Archway project, so perhaps to re-expose some of that archaeology which for the last 40 years has been completely buried again. The way in which they're going to help the development of the Undercroft is to give them some fairly crucial information about what impact the, the proposed development of the Undercroft here will have on any of the levels of, of the surviving Roman archaeology. We're hoping to reveal more about the baths down here. Obviously the Roman baths complex is much bigger than what the public can see, so there are additional baths down here that we're really interested to find out more about. It's here that we're going to create an investigation zone where young people will be able to study uh, Roman remains from the archaeological site and uh, there will also be a space where they can even do a trial excavation. Compared to some of the other investigations I've, I've worked on over the years, this, this is pretty special to be honest with you. It's, it's, it's really rare we get to work, work in a site so interesting, so well known. What we're hoping to achieve really is to expose the archaeology, get it looking nice and clean and enable the people who are designing the Archway project to look at the best way in which they can incorporate that into their design. So there might be some areas where they'll take a look and think, OK, that's probably not so interesting, not so photogenic. Whereas other areas they might look at the bath behind us, for example, and think that actually looks really good. Um, we'll design that in such a way that the public can look at that in the same way that they do in other areas of the Roman baths where stumps of walls below our feet, they can suspend walls above those so that you actually look at the Roman space as it was rather than just the remains at ground floor level. What they're doing now is they're being archaeologists. This is their job, this is what they do. When children come in groups or other learners in groups, then they will become archaeologists and they will dig in our excavation pit. What we hope schools will get out of it is finding out about archaeology, inspiring them to do a bit more research in school, making projects and Maybe we'll get some archaeologists in the future because of the work that they will have done on a school visit here.